menu animation in principle. In the exercise file for principle, you will get a file, this one, the sketch file. Open this file in sketch, travel app menu bar, animation.sketch, this one. Okay. So open this one in sketch. Then open a new file in principle. And now click this one. Click import. Travel app menu bar animation dot sketch. Click import. So principle will import three artboards. Zoom in. Uh, zoom out. Okay. So the first one we have is the we have the bar hotel and travel. We have to reorder this one. So we need this travel screen here, then hotel, then bar. So take this one, travel, drag this one up to re reorder. So the first one is travel now. Second one is bar. And bring the bar to the bottom. So bar goes on the right hand side. So travel, hotel, and bar. We will make animation for these three artboards. So the user will click the hotel, then it will take him to this screen, this artboard. So double click here to select only the hotel text. It's selected. Click the uh, lightning icon, select tap, and drag the link to here in hotel, artboard. Now again, select this one, the bar, click this one the lightning icon, uh, click tap, and then drag this one to the bar artboard. So now we have two links. One is a small arrow, hotel copy, and the other one is bar, which is the longer line. Next is select this one, the travel. So double click on travel text. The text will be selected from the layer panel, and we see it's selected. Click the lightning icon, click tap, and drag to the travel artboard. Now click this one, the bar. Uh, click the lightning icon, click tap, and drag to the bar screen. So these two screens, the animation is finished. Now take this one, travel, lightning icon, click and drag to the travel artboard, select hotel, double click here, sorry, single click, tap and drag to the hotel screen. So we have finished our menu bar animation. Now go to the view menu, select picture in picture. Now click this one, travel, refresh from here, travel, click the hotel. Yeah, we see the hotel, click the bar. Yeah, we see the bar artboard. Now again, hotel, travel, great. Bring this one here. Okay, now select this, the hotel. Double click here and you see this one, the hotel copy. Click this one. Then in the timeline, you will see that the animation for this uh, hotel screen. And if you don't see the, this timeline, click here, animate, and it will appear. Now you see the line here. This line. This line animation. If you take this one, it has a few seconds only. Sorry, a few milliseconds. If you click this one, this uh, diamond icon, and drag this one to one second. And let's view in the picture in picture. Now we have the travel. We already made the transition, like one second. If we click now hotel, see it's moving very slowly. This line is moving very slowly beneath the hotel. Okay. And if we increase the time frame to two seconds, see what happened? And click the hotel. It's going more slowly. Okay. And we can make the 
ease in, ease out. Here you'll see that its default is now. Select the easy in, and the line will be like this. It will go slow to fast. See now? Slow and then fast. Let's change the easy in to easy out. It goes fast, then slow. Okay. And we put the easy uh, both. That means it will slowly in, then fast again, and slowly out. See that? It's slowly in, then moves faster, then slowly out again. Now we can manipulate this more by this handle. So we can change the movement. Let's see now. We make it custom. See how the animation now, it's moving slowly, then fast, and then make a, makes a bounce. Let's see the spring. We already saw the spring in Flinto, but let's see how the spring works here. See, it makes a bounce when it's going beneath the hotel. And with uh, some motion, and another one is linear, it doesn't go slow or fast. Well, it's going in the same pace. It goes with the same pace. Okay. So this is how you can manipulate the the animation by clicking this one you can change from here this one every animation every line coming from here into there from one screen to another screen 